Oh, hi. Hello. I didn't realize this place is occupied. This is fair. Oh God. <laughs> right. What have you say, buddy? Gotcha. Oof. I was trying not to use my health potions there. I don't. I don't know why. It's just. I view this as a little personal challenge at times. Ah, Stonefield. You're looking quite majestic. I vaguely remember there was a Duchess or something that uh, lived here. Howdy, my god, sir. Haltet ein! Ihr habt euch eines Verbrechens schuldig gemacht. Entweder zahlt ihr das Kopfgeld, das auf euch ausgewiesen ist, oder ihr geht ins Gefängnis. Um, I, ah, uh, what does that crime? <laughs> it was probably any, any number of things I've done, like theft or magic in towns. Who knows? Let's go to jail. Rede. Jemand wie ihr sollte nicht auf die Leute losgelassen werden. Oh, that's just mean, isn't it? Crafting a block would decrease by one. Oof. A block, though. What is my block? Ah, 25 block I used to have. I feel like that was a, a, a important milestone to have come across, but anyway. Suckling pig. Good gods. That's... <laughs> That's epic. Oh. Yes. Give me my ham. That's good. Um, do you know a person that maybe forged a sword? Actually, I'll talk to this fella. Martin! Ja, was kann ich für euch tun? Oh, Melton, uh, do you remember this here dagger? Hm, was haben wir denn da? Einen Dolch aus meiner Schmiede. Ja, ganz bestimmt. Ich erinnere mich, dass ich ihn eigenhändig angefertigt habe. Nun, er war für die fürstliche Familie bestimmt gewesen. Aber die hat ihn nie bekommen, weil er mir damals gestohlen wurde. Ich hätte nie gedacht, ihn noch mal wiederzusehen. Nun... Aber jetzt hätte ich ihn natürlich gerne zurück. Was haltet ihr von einem Tausch? Verkaufen könnt ihr diesen Dolch ohnehin nicht. Jeder Händler würde ihn für Diebesgut halten, denn so etwas Feines besitzen nur Fürsten und Könige. Wenn ihr mir also den Dolch zurückgebt, dann schenke ich euch einen anderen aus meiner Schmiede, und zwar einen, mit dem man wirklich kämpfen kann. Und wenn ihr wollt, erzähle ich euch auch noch, wie ich diesen Dolch damals verloren habe. Well, it seems I have no choice but to agree. Ausgezeichnet. Nun, es war folgendermaßen damals. Ich weiß, dass ein Kind in mir gestohlen hatte. Ein ziemlich junges sogar noch. Kleines Balk. Pa. Es saß immer da drüben, bei den Holzscheiten und beobachtete mich beim Schmieden. Zu der Zeit lagerten einige Söldner vor der Burg. Das Kind war mit ihnen gekommen. Nun, ihr wisst schon, das war, als sich Taranor gerade von Baratheon losgesagt und sein eigenes kleines Reich errichtet hatte. Überall im Land gab es Kämpfe, das Mittelreich gegen das Nordreich und mittendrin allerlei Söldner und Abenteurer. Ganz besonders schlimm war es am Totenpass, nicht weit weg von hier. Dieses kleine Dorf dort, Ledur, kann ein Lied davon singen. Komplett niedergebrannt haben sie's. Fast alle Bewohner sind gestorben. Die wenigen Überlebenden trafen dann zusammen mit einigen Söldnern hier ein. Das Kind war bei ihnen, hatte wohl seine Eltern verloren. Den Rest kennt ihr ja schon. Es hat den Dolch mitgenommen und mir damit ziemliche Scherereien eingebrockt. Der alte Herr Boddenbrook war sehr, sehr zornig, das kann ich euch sagen. Dagegen ist seine kleine Göre ein sanftes Kätzchen. Nun, lassen wir das. Danke, dass ihr die Klinge zurückgebracht habt. Diesen Dolch hier gebe ich euch als Finderlohn. Lebt wohl. 
Damn, okay. So we were part of a, well, a little wandering merchant. I don't know why I keep pushing control. Um, oh, I lost my train of thought. Yeah, was can ich für euch tun? What do you sell? What did, what did you give me? A stone field? Ta wow. It's not bad. But it's not good either. Do you want it back for 19 gold? I'll hang on to it for now. Okay. So it looks like we were part of a town beforehand and then the wandering bands and mercenaries picked us up and took us here for a smidge before probably dropping us off at the abbey. And that's updated our journal actually, so we could look at that too. The smith actually remembered I was a refugee from Lido and stole the dagger from his forge in Stonefield. When the mercenaries brought me here to the camp, whatever my reason were, I must now find this letter, or at least what is left of it. Ah, it's further up the, the thing, so... Yeah, that makes... that does okay, because we can just maybe do a loop around or just go there and teleport back to the sanctum eventually. I like it. I like it a lot. What does this do? Ooh, that is cool. I don't know why it's cool, but it is. Oh. Right. <laughs> that wasn't the exit. <laughs> That's where they dump all their waste. <laughs> oh, God. Well, I suppose if people knew who I was, they'll probably think of me as waste as well. And, you know, trash in society. Being more magic inclined than that. Now, where the heck am I? And how the hell do I get back on... Oh, gods. Save me, nasty kobold. I'm fairly certain that a black wolf is not something to be toyed with. Those are the experience games. Oh, see now, Shadow Wolf. Holy shit, this nasty kobold is insane, man. But it, it was seen now, though. So we, we don't quite know how truly strong this bastard was. I'm sure he's still pretty damn strong though, but uh, I'm glad that my cobalt took the brunt of that damage. Handle the axe swinger. Ja bitte. Ihr wundert euch wohl, was eine Gruppe bis an die Zähne bewaffneter Krieger hier vor der Burg macht. Wir warten, um ehrlich zu sein. Ich darf euch aber nicht mehr verraten. Tut mir leid. That is fair, I suppose. Ungeziefer, allesamt. Ah, oh, yes, the Eterna. Yes, they're definitely horrid people. So, do you know what... Okay, that's good. I'm pretty sure as a mercenary you're going to run into a fair bit of that eventually. What's this Traveler doing with his guard? I see, you are definitely on duty. Good man. I wanted to talk to your donkey, not to you. Gods. Oh, God. Okay, donkey. Okay. Alright, dude. Stop showing off. <laughs> what? <laughs> Alright. I've managed to separate this dude from his, his uh, guard. Oh no, there we go. Just ignore the nasty cobalt. It, I don't know what that is. It definitely wasn't me who summoned it. So don't, just don't, uh, you know, give me another bounty. I really can't afford to be going to jail anymore. Ooh, what's this? Stone Band of Hardening. Hello. Strength and life by five points. Oh, hell yeah. Totally up for that. That's pretty good, man. Pretty good haul. And some useless stuff. Steel arrow. Wow, okay. Useful. Very useful. Damn, Lord Pie, man. That's a pretty nice looking get up. You look very noble right now. I'm pretty sure you can pass yourself off as a, a noble and maybe even sell that bow. Oh, not the bow, the dagger. Should have kept hold of that dagger to wear this stuff, huh? Oh well. You live and learn. I see this place is well guarded, huh? Very well guarded. Nasty kobold. 
aid me in taking on this horrid chicken. I mean, rooster. <laughs> Alright. Looks like, uh, despite the fact that the town burnt, the uh, chickens decided to, to take over the town. This is the chicken's town now. Ah, I've arrived at the ruins of my home village. As I walked around, a strange feeling came over me. My childhood suddenly appeared before my eyes as if it were here just yesterday. Well, that's good to know. Okay, maybe that's not, not good to know at all, actually. This is terrifying. <laughs> oh my god. And my invisible torch is equipped. Am I invisible? <sighs> Ooh, that's cool. I like that. Well, let's get... Uh, Let's get to looking around whilst we're invisible, so we won't be attacked, thankfully. Permanent- oh my jeez. Mama! Papa! Those hooded men do not look like as if they are in a panic over the attack. Something is not right about them. Perhaps I should follow them. You know, this is- this is a very vivid- oh, okay. Visitor, no! Why are you dead? Ah, hooded men. Oh gosh, the guards are actually attacking them, but they're running away from the guards. Mm. Which one do I follow? Are you? Oh, you're just a, a regular merc. Wait for me. Thank the guards you're waiting. Oh. That hatch. I absolutely must find out what lies below it. Yeah, definitely a good thing that I was certainly paying much attention to where I was. This is my house before her. Huh. Oh. Not much left of it, but let's find that hatch then. If I remember correctly, it was down this way. And around here? Okay, oh, there it is. Gotcha. It looks like fragile. With a pickaxe, I should be able to break it down. Oh, I've got a pickaxe. Oh, careful, Lord Pie. Safety first. Eh. Okay. Ah, we got through. Excellent. Hello, secret vault. What lies below, I wonder? Should I be worried? I don't think so. <laughs> uh, it's Nero we're talking about. I should definitely be worried about everything. Um, sure, I'll take, I'll take that. It just in a chest randomly there, right, sure, okay. Gotcha. Hello? Hooded figures that escaped into the secret vault? Where do you lead? Oh my god. Damn, spooked me, man. Sudden change in colour. Wow. This looks very valuable. What is it? Like, what the heck were we sitting on top of? Like... I feel like we're in a very profitable location, but we just didn't capitalize on it. Maybe not, because there's not much of that there, but just one giant piece to sit in there. I just wonder how much that'll be worth for mining purposes. Crikey, this is quite an intricate vault that we had below the city. Or the town. I'm, I'm mightily impressed. Who built this? What was the reason for it? Let's hope we find answers to these questions. What do they do in their days off? Hello? Ah. Huh. Traps that have already been triggered, huh? Right. So something was either down here and triggered the traps and long gone. Or oh, it's still around. Possibly its corpse may have rotted away by now. So we should be okay. Double check, we're not missing anything. Nope, all good. Okay. Ah, okay, there's another. Nope, no, that's not a tunnel. Confused I am. Aha, found it. Slightly blind, but slightly not blind, it seems. Uh, mostly blind, actually. Oh good, pickaxes. Just in case you break your previous pickaxe. Breaking that wall down, maybe? Very good of them to supply with pickaxes. That 
maybe hostile. Take a weak shot. <laughs> okay. We'll just keep you out just in case you decide you want to attack me. Oh no, you're very much spooked by me. Hmm. It's more afraid of me than I am of it, huh? Run, little baddies, run. Come on. Go, 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 go. Oh, jeez, hi. That more spooked me again. Oh, he's stuck. Let's get you unstuck. There you go. You're free. But forever's tra- oh. Not good. Don't mind me as I quickly just <laughs> uh, change out of my outfit into this this bad boy. Cross spider. Ooh, terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Take a lot. They take a lot of knocks. Okay, so we know this place is, uh, is bad news bears. I'm fairly sure those bats are actually hurting me, but I wasn't paying attention to that. Let's just double check this theory. Hello! Why is my health so low? Oh wait, no, I lit myself on fire in my dream. Never mind. It's totally fine. I remember now. Kind of weird that you go to bed and it says how long would you like to wait. And when I did that before, it didn't actually heal my health. So it technically makes me wait rather than sleep and regenerate health. Oh, paint palette. Use that for some painting. Paintbrush. Very good. Got all the almost all the ingredients. Hello. A ruined iron longsword. Bad, not bad. Ooh, middle realm. Okay. Calipers, resistance to the fighters, battle axe, interesting, oops, didn't mean to pick that up, but okay. Since the generations of our great grandfather and their fathers, this has been our land, our home. This is why we must fight now. Baratian soldiers rob us of what is ours. They penetrate into our pure country to rob and pillage. They take our young sons and make them into chancellor soldiers. So. We must fight to preserve what is ours. There can be no peace, not with Baratian, a man of magic, steel, and lies. Yeah. So our parents are part of a resistance, as it were. It looks like the bandits out in the castle near the village were not entirely innocent. They were in on the fighting in and around Lido. They have artificially provoked both sides of the Middle and Northern Realms, so that their organization here could continue the activities undisturbed. The city was destroyed, our house burnt down and our parents murdered. I wonder who were the mercenaries, who took me to safety. Well, there is not much more I can learn about my past here. Ever since Taranor renounced the Chancellor Baratheon over the high losses in the South Realm, fighting broke out everywhere in the land, as if we actually care. Unfortunately both sides are now just waiting for on our doorstep to devour each other, but they are waiting too long for me. All this waiting is bad for our business. As long as they camp out there and wait, our thieves cannot leave the castle to rob trading convoys. There are just too many eyes watching. We must do something. Here is what I want you to do. Start stirring up the mood in two camps. Spread propaganda. Disguise yourselves and kill one from each side, if it is necessary. You can use the secret tunnel from the castle to Le Deux. Your work now begins. The Banner Prince of Le Deux. Ah, oh, okay. Right, gotcha. So they provoked, yeah, violence and whatnot, and they were the hood figures that probably escaped through here at some point. Very interesting. Can I pick the lock because I need a key? Oh, gee, scamp man. You dumb one spooked me again. Right, it's three times I got, just got spooked by innocent things. Now, is there a key on this table? Or do I have to go the long way around? It looks like I have to go the long way around. I very much doubt they'll leave a key down here. 
But you never know, they could, they could have just dropped it in the hurry to get out. Oh, I suppose that that gives us a little mission to go and find that bandit prince and let him know what for. That we found out his dirty little secret and have revenge. Hey, scamp, I hope that's you, nasty kobold. Yes, you friendly. Good man. Alright, back to meeting up with Aranthiel, but before that I think we have to go and pay homage to the statue at some point. Or well, somewhere along the lines, so we'll go and do that after a little dip in the water. Ah, very good.